Okay, Gary, we're going to take a look at the new Amiga 500 and the Amiga 2000, and we'll see some of the new exciting software that is being written for the Amiga. We're going to begin by going to Oakland, California, and taking a look at a man who uses an Amiga plus Digiview and Deluxe Paint to make a living as a professional photographer and designer. Larry Keenan is a San Francisco photographer who has added the Amiga to his collection of photographic equipment. Working with a video camera, a digitizer, and a software package called Digiview, Larry can create new images directly on screen. Basically, it's a logical extension of my business uh, because I work with um, a lot of different elements in photos. That The digitizing process was like an, another brush. It's just another technique. It uh, allows me to take a photograph that I've already have in a stock file and resize it, um, take out elements, for instance, you have a favorite photograph that you want to use for something, and it's got telephone lines all in it. It's got cyclone fences, lots of problems. And you can go in and you can digitize these areas out. Larry is well known for his ad work and magazine covers, and increasingly for his artwork decorating software packages. The computer gives him a definite advantage in dealing with the deadlines imposed by commercial work, and it lets him be more independent. And this is the main difference um, in this technology. It allows artists, photographers, illustrators, anyone in, in the art field to take an image, digitize it on their own terms, and present it, rather than being a victim of a, of a, of a technician basically doing it. And you have no input, none. Making the switch from a sharp lens to a fuzzy monitor is not without its problems. Larry regrets the low resolution of a computer screen compared to photographic film. And he finds it hard to keep up with constant changes in the technology. But he's optimistic. The trick is to learn the process because that won't change. Just the quality will change in the future. And that's the important part.